Hey there, it's Maria at Freestyle Homeschooling. And today I'm going to show you inside ACE Math 5th grade. Okay, so I have a few of them here and I'm just going to show you inside. ACE curriculum uses um, booklets. It's 12 booklets per subject for each grade. So this is 5th grade math. And in the beginning of each pace, you will always find the goals. And then there is a character trait. There's a Bible verse. And then there's always a little comic um, on the character trait. There's sections in the book where it'll ask for a supervisor initial. Okay, so that's usually when you have to read something out loud. Um, you, have, you have to have a supervisor to sign it. Okay, so let me just show you inside so you can have an idea. Okay, the, the paces have all the uh, instructions inside, so it does not have a teacher's manual, okay? It always explains it. It has instructions here, and then practice. Now, ACE is designed um, for the student to pretty much work on their own, and also to grade their own uh, booklet but I'm, I'm not doing that. I just have my kids work on it and then I'm doing the grading. Okay, so it explains it and then it has the practice. I'll show you inside a little more. And the reason I'm doing these videos are because sometimes people are curious about ACE the way I was but then you're not sure what the curriculum looks like. You're not sure if it's going to work for your family or not. So I'm trying to do some of these uh, videos where you can actually see inside. Okay. Also, if you order from christianbook.com, they have a few sample pages, but I've noticed that on some of them, it'll only show you um, the very first page and then like the cover and then another, maybe one more page. So sometimes I feel like it doesn't give you um, like a real feel on what the book is about. Okay, here's another one. Like I said, they all have goals, um, character trait, Bible verse, and a little comic. Okay. They're very colorful. Um, kind of straight to the point. And then in the middle of each pace, there is always um, a test. So you pull the test out, pull it out. And then once the student has completed the pace, um, then they can take the test. Okay. Also, um, pa the paces are... Um, self-directed, self-paced, but they do recommend that the student uh, completes a pace about every three weeks. Okay. So that's the recommendation that it should take about three weeks to finish a pace. So if you calculate it um, every three weeks, so for example, it should take three weeks to do a math pace, um, English pace and whatever other paces it should take a week so if you calculate it it comes out to about 30 you finish the 12 um, paces in about 36 weeks okay which is technically kind of the an estimate of what a school year is now it, uh, it all depends on your child the child might finish it in two weeks and then it also depends if the student understands and you know finishes quickly the student might finish in two weeks. If it's one area where they're having trouble, it might take them a little bit longer. But a rough estimate, it should be about three weeks to finish each pace, each pace. This is the score key. So just so you have an idea what it looks like inside.
So it's not a teacher's manual. It is just um, the answers to the work. Okay. Now, um, ACE Ministries is the website that you would go to, and they have a diagnostic test that the student can do online. It doesn't cost you a thing. Uh, the student will take the diagnostic test, and that way they can figure out what grade level the student will be in for English, for reading, and for math. Okay. Also, you can find um, they sell kits at ACE Ministries or at ChristianBook.com. They you can buy a kit where it'll give you um, some goal goal charts, <laughs> where the student will write their goals on how many pages um, the student wants to do each day. Also, they have, and I'll show you a little sample I printed out. <clears throat> Give me one second here. But they also have an example of like a progress report. So you would just um, write the percentage. And this is not my real child. This is just the example that they have there. But they have a progress report. They have um, the scope and sequence where, <clears throat> excuse me, so you can find the scope and sequence for all the grades from kindergarten up to 12th grade for every subject. Um, here's the example. They also have um, for their academic records. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so that's good for high school. They have a master record. Okay, and like I said, this is just a sample. I'm going to create my own um, so that it, you know, suits our home, our family. This is what the goal, oh no, this is not the goal chart, but this is where um, you put a star for, for example, math. They finish the first pace on the third week. They finish the next pace on the sixth week and so on. Okay, and you know, and I like the way this is structured Instead of a full textbook, it's in packets, so the student feels accomplishment. Um, you know, oh, I've, I finished, now I can move on to the next one. They can see their progress. So I think it's a, it's a really nice uh, curriculum. It's very affordable. Um, there, there are curriculums out there where you probably can spend anywhere from like $500 to $800 per child for a year. Now, that does not compare to sending your child to a private school where you would probably probably pay about $400 a month per child. And it does not compare to the amount that a public school spends. The estimated spending uh, in public school is about, it changes, but I believe it's about $10,000 per child per year. Um, the ACE curriculum costs about roughly 250 maybe the most 300 but about 250 dollars per child uh, for the whole school year you can purchase it at christianbook.com you can purchase it at ace ministries and another thing i really like about um, this curriculum is that you don't have to purchase the whole entire packet as well if you don't have a lot of money to spend you know all at once you can buy each each one individually and I believe like each pace is about three dollars and twenty cents or three dollars and fifty cents okay so you can buy it individually and that way you buy it maybe by quarter um, so you buy the first three months then you buy the next three months and so on so it's very affordable there are other YouTube channels that um, review AC curriculum just so Trish and Andrea Mills Andrea Mills uses ACE curriculum for all her kids, which I'm not, I don't remember. She has like five or six kids um, that are homeschooling. She uses it for all of her kids. She graduated from ACE curriculum. So she has a lot of really good ideas. So if you want to check her out, um, Andrea Mills. So that's it for today. That was ACE fifth grade math.